Babe. Babe, wake up. Hey. Now, you're probably wondering why you woke you up. Normally, I don't like waking you up, but... You look like you were having a bad dream. Were you? Oh. The bad dream just started? Okay, okay. You don't have to keep insulting me. I know you don't like being here with me, but... I really like you, and... Well... It's not exactly going as I'd hoped it would, but here we are, so I know if I do let you back out anyways, you're just gonna call the police and get me arrested, so I can't have that now, can I? What? You and I both know that's true. You wouldn't just leave here and be like, yeah, I'll forgive him for that. You can lie to me all you want. I'm not letting you go. But anyways, I brought you some food and water. And I know that you like pink lemonade, so I decided to get you some of that. Why did I do that? Well, it would be better than the water you've been drinking for the last, I don't know, two months you've been down here. You should be happy that I even bring you food and water three times a day. With the way you've been treating me, I've been considering... Maybe cutting your food supply down a little bit, but obviously that wouldn't be right, and that would be pretty unhealthy for you, so I decided going against that. You're welcome. You know, you could make this easier for the both of us and just start treating me right. What do you mean I'm not treating you right? I've literally been giving you free housing free food, my company. You didn't ask for any of it? I know you didn't, but like, come on. This is just me giving my love to you, whether you like it or not. I know it's forced, but how else was I going to get you to love me? You've just been being like, no, I don't like you, and blocking me and all the new numbers I've been creating, and Every time I send you an email, you never reply, so I don't even know if you got those. I don't know. You've been just very bratty. I'm starting to really consider if I even really like you. Good? Why do you say that? Because you don't like me, and if I don't like you, you're hoping I'll let you go? That's not exactly how this works, sweetheart. But, good try. Just a word of advice. I think you should start treating me better, or else I might have to start doing things... Hmm. A little bit more... Drastic. What do I mean by that? Well, you'll just have to find out. But, I'm going back upstairs now. I'll see you in three hours. Bye, my love. Alright, now that I gave her the pink lemonade, which is actually a love potion. Now, I'm not entirely sure how a love potion even works because I have never heard of such a thing before. And to be quite frank, I thought that witch was crazy that I was buying it from. So, I doubt it will really do anything, but if it does... We'll probably see after I come down again. Well, let's go ahead and take a short nap and we'll see if it does anything. <sighs> what time is it? Oh, it's been four hours. I'm one hour late. Dang it. I knew I shouldn't have taken a nap without setting an alarm. Oh well. Let me go ahead and see my love, and hopefully she's different this time around. Let me go ahead and open this door. Hey, darling. Has everything been good down here? You, you what? You were waiting for me? Well, that's a new one. Why exactly did you want me? You like talking to me? Well, 
when I was here just a few hours ago, you were saying the complete opposite, like how you wanted to leave and you hated talking to me and, well, I'm just kind of surprised to hear that, but hey, you know, people can change. Oh. You wanted to know if we could cuddle? Well, I wouldn't be opposed to it. It's just, last time I tried to do that, you started kicking and screaming, saying, Don't touch me, and get away. And, well, obviously I didn't want to make you more upset, so I just stopped. So, you sure you really want to cuddle this time? Okay, here. Lay down on top of me. I've been honestly wondering... How do you look so good, even though you've been down here for two months and not even having any sun? I guess you're just born pretty. Aw, babe. Do you really think I'm pretty? That's very sweet. But I just have one question. Are you feeling alright? Because literally an hour ago, or a couple hours ago, you were like a completely different person. Oh, you think you're starting to warm up to me? Well, that's always good, but if this is just an act to let me, or make me think that you're trying to become, you know, nicer with me to let you go, I promise you that will not work. So if this is an act, just drop it. Because you're going to have to act for a very, very long time to get out of here. It's not an act? Well, I guess we'll see in a couple of years then, won't we? If you're really, really committed to it, I'm sure that won't be a problem for you if you actually are starting to warm up to me. Isn't that right? Okay then, if you say so. But I'll get used to this if you're always going to act like this. But just so you know, even though I kind of act cold to you, I've always really loved you. And I've been just waiting for a moment like this where we could spend some time together without you acting all bratty and getting all defensive and mean. I really do love you, babe. But I'm going to go back upstairs and cook us some dinner. Was there anything you wanted? You wanted to go with me? Well, babe, I said you're not going to be leaving here for a little while, but I can make you something special for... Allowing us to, um, cuddle for a little bit. Yeah, I can make that. Alright, I'll see you in a little bit, babe. I'll be right back. 